What's up, me guys? It's me guys, me bros, me zombies, whatever you want to be called nowadays. It's Floppy Zombie here, and I'm bringing you some more Sonic and Knuckles. This time, I'm starting with Sonic because I'm gonna see if you guys will be able to see any difference between the two Sonic and Knuckles. And if you haven't played either of them, you are weird. And I just can totally biff that. But oh well. Let's get a super speed on, bitch. Up here because we can kill these little butterflies again, and um, basically, I just thought you know, I'm gonna start making uploads more often. I'm gonna try my best. I know I've been the most unreliable uploader in the world lately, and I know you probably can't hear this, so I'll turn it up on the stage. And um, oh, holy Jesus, that was a bit weird stuff, anyway. So, yeah, I know I've been the most reliable when it comes to uploads. I'm gonna try and stop that. I'm gonna start trying to upload at least once a week. And if I can't do that, I'll just Fair, we're gonna carry on like uploading my one on one video for no apparent reason. Anyway, so. Something to talk about in this video. Hey, we've already seen this level and that guy should have hit me then. Oh well. I'm still playing on keyboard, so. I may look like I've improved, but I really haven't. <laughs> I was just playing really bad that day, as of course. You know what I mean? You know the days where you, you know you can do better, but you're just playing really, really bad. He should hit me again. That's where I got hit randomly with knuckles at one point. Kill this little mushroom guy and just get up there. Kill him because he's the bane of my existence. And we're gonna be just like getting through this level. There's the boss already. I mean, come on now. I'm gonna I might I might fit level one and two into this so you do have something a little bit different to see. I mean, the final boss you will see a difference. And I think this boss should see a difference, yeah, because last time he hit it downwards and we didn't expect it and I got dicked on by him and we're just going to do the same method again, so I'm going to do that and let this drop and give us the 10 rings. So I'm going to pick up the 10 rings now and just get a free life, why the hell not? It's one thing to take note about this level, you can get a free life by doing that. Wah. Anyway. So, this looks like it may be a short episode, so yeah, I think I'll try and get level 2 in here as well, maybe level 3. We'll see how far this recording session goes. And there's a difference between Knuckles and Sonic here. As Knuckles, you run straight for that. As Sonic, Knuckles pulls this switch and you go up here. And if you come to the left, it's a superpower thing here. So, yeah. One thing to take note of Sonic. The awesome music. Kill off this guy. Oh god, he gets me again, stupid guy thing. Worst enemy in Sonic history! Anyway, so carrying on. As you can see, I'm playing this a bit rushed right now. It's probably why I just lost. Ouch. I recommend to try and jump on you blowing, but yeah. Again, just. Oh god. Come in here and get some free rings. It's always fun to have free rings jump over this guy because I'm not really bothering with him anymore. So yeah, what to talk about in this video? Eh? Well, first I'm getting off the ball farm name, which is always nice. And the chicken just could ah! Oh my god, how did I hit him? Now this bit's different as well because there's knuckles we could walk through there, but something we can't. So you have to do this, kind of go like that and get up there like so and get on that. That's how you're supposed to do this, Sonic. I'm really surprised at that first try because I'm never usually be able to, I'm never usually able to do that. Let's see what we're gonna do. Let's just carry on going this way and there's another guy here. Yep, I'm gonna do it. Oh god! Go over him, good boy. Just jump on this guy, go in there and do the first bonus round. Now one thing I'm gonna do with this, these bonus rounds, I'm just gonna speed them up and add a bit of music. So yeah, enjoy that. I'll be back with you in a minute.
back with Mushroom Hill Zone. Do -do. And yeah, so let's go. Chicken does not respawn, thankfully. He does, he's just chilling out there. Well, that's on the side of him, I saw him, but yeah. Just popping up here, as you do. Jump into this. I said jump into this. That's how you do it. Down roll, kill that guy. I'm surprised I killed that guy because I jumped straight through his spikes. I think Sonic seems to be glitchy on this game. You know, oh, there's a boss. Hello, Eggman. Get on this side and just keep spamming him. I don't know how you don't get hit in time like that as well. I mean, come on, Sonic. I know you're awesome and all that. But yeah, I didn't think. Oh, Jesus. I didn't think it was. Ooh, this time I'm not going to die on the first boss. See? Oh, yeah. And this one. And yeah, I'm going to carry this on to the next video. So once again, I'm going to see this bit. I'll just, like, meet you at the end of this, I suppose. So yeah. Actually, I might as well talk through it, you know. Just say that at the end of this video, uh, I'm going to leave a channel link. And um, I want you to check it out. I mean, it's my friend from college. He's new to YouTube. He has, like, seven subscribers. And if you like Minecraft, he does. he's doing Minecraft videos. Obviously he's like, like I said, he's new, so obviously he's not the best in the world at commentating and all that, but I want you to go show him some support, show him some love, if you want to. I mean, that's still up to you, but that's only if you really like Minecraft, I'm not saying, oh, go sub to him, because I said so, because I am the zombie man, you know? Oh, Jesus, I pressed the wrong button to jump. Yeah. <laughs> oh, God. Anyway. So, yeah, just check him out. I'll leave his link in the description, and I'll just... If I remember, I should put a mention to him at the end of this video. If you just kill this rock in here, there's free life right here. Kill that one. You don't have to, but you can because he's there. Jump on this doohickey here. Jump on this doohickey here. Jump on these. Uh, I'll show you something about fire in a second. Oh, like that. If you double jump A, you can stand this. If you double jump, you do this little crazy dash. You stand on these for like too long. Yeah. Also, at the end of this video, actually, thinking about it, there is going to be another link in the description and whatnot. Because this guy I'm advertising, he mainly does videos with his friend. So, yeah, that's kind of the purpose of his videos. He doesn't, he's going to do a lot with his friend, I reckon. Of course, he's got some, he's got, he's got like, I don't know, a few videos, a couple of them solo, most of them with this other guy. So, just check them both out, why the frick not, you know? And, uh, yeah. So yeah, that's just one thing to take note of. Any of you don't, I probably just sort of got out of that one. I hate this bit of the level, this like only bit. Ah! I don't like this bit of the level at all. I could I just panic because these things are annoying. You wanna jump on this? You wanna jump on this? You wanna jump on this one? I'll wait for those. Jump here. Collecting rings is optional, obviously. Oh, now because I've got fire, I can just do it. Like, avoid that one because it has enemies inside. Just pro tip there, that one has enemies. Yeah, they shoot the missiles at you. I just, oh god, I just barely avoided that. If you want to choose which direction you hold, go in on this, you hold the direction in what you want to jump. Otherwise, it's just, I think it's either just straightforward or random. You just follow the trailer cord, you always get onto the place you want to go anyway. I cannot remember for the life of me where the secret entrance is in this level, so. I know there's one somewhere because there's a secret entrance you get in through bombs. I think it's through bombs. And uh, yeah. Let's take note. Power ups like fire and electricity like, bounce off attack like that. If you got there, there's something you can do as knuckles. Anyway, like, uh, one thing to take note of is doing this is do that. But jump a here because that's where we get you. <laughs> so now we've got invisibility again. And I just noticed I got another life from 180 rings. Anyway, we can just run in this direction. We can never make that. Never ever make that. Ooh, that was lucky. Okay, I'm gonna that one. Pass and badoosh. Ooh. You get very lucky on this game at the minute. I'm kind of surprised this one could happen. This one's just a normal spring, so it doesn't release anything. I don't know why they put it in there like that, but yeah. Just carry on going this way, and this will drop. There isn't, actually, the secret ending there, there's an alternate way to go. Don't attempt to move back because it will fall on you. Hmm, let's learn. 
you can just use these springs that really help you out that much. This one does though. But there's a lot of gone, I'm gonna stay here. You wanna jump, jump again, because that will hurt you. Just let this go up. Go to your right. Come on, this is another just plain spring again. I don't know why they did it like that. Probably hinting you about something. Hinting you about something. No, 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 I'm not gonna do Douche. Anyway, I'm a bit cautious because I'm, I'm pretty sure these bombs can't. Yeah, well, they can't kind of hurt you. Oh, pfft. yeah, they can hurt you. Yeah, I, like I said, I always got cautious because I've never actually been hit by one, but I never wanted to. So I never really tried to run into them, see if I could get hit, and that was a learning experience for both of us. Or all of us, whatever you want to say. Oh, Jesus. Jump. Get in there. So as long as you've got rings that bit, you should be fine. But yeah. If I do that bit again, it's kind of boring. Kind of boring to watch this when you've already seen it. Oh, oh God. Oh, he did it. Everybody, bro. Anyway, just stand here and you'll be fine. Well, they'll fly up. It takes like three times. Oh no, two. Okay. Two times you watch and that'll just happen. And just continue on down here. We just ignore him. Here's the boss. Basically simple, you wait for his arm to move down and start flashing the usual off him. He does have a pattern, he goes his arms go in, so don't think it's like the direction you're facing or anything stupid like that. Because it's really not. He has a pattern and about one more hit and gone. Pretty easy boss to be honest, I mean that's it. And then the thing goes inside there and you can do a wee. There you go. So let's move on to flying battery zone. Let's go. P. And then just leave. Just don't do anything. You get to do that. Again, don't do anything. There, I did that by mistake. You go in the middle one. No, you don't. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. That mouse thing's there. Oh, God. Oh, God. Ah! Now we get the first insight of this doohickey. Yeah, the electric shield lets you do a double jump like this. Because I can use this in a look. It attracts rings. The rings will come your way. It's actually a really good power up to have. These things can get annoying, so down to your arms, you'll get crushed. Like, yeah. You can choose to take this power for a low power, I'm just going to go on this one, because it's there. You know what I mean? Is there? No, there's not. Uh, ooh, oh god, I picked the hard one. It's very easy to go weird and glitch in this and do that. The actual three aspect of that bit is really bad in this game. And now I've got to start this whole level again. Oh, Jesus. Oh, sorry, but it, well, I guess you have to watch all this happy, fun stuffs again. So, yeah, again, just like pick left or right, doesn't really matter. Do. Whoa! Um. Okay, whatever. We'll take the low path this time. Yep, yeah, that one's enemies again. I thought it would have been. A weird feeling about that one. Do 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 do. There is a spring there. Don't be alarmed. I think oh my god, I'm stuck. Stand still and you avoid that bull brush. Uh, this thing, you need to let it grab you. Do a you over there. Go over there, jump, and then you just go over there. Do 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 do. What's it? Anyway, you can't speed that obviously because you're a beast. Anyway. Oh, that was a bit of a fail. Oh, up here. Ring, 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 ring. 
Those things are really cool. The idea was to spin dash. Oh, got invincibility frames for the fucking win that. All that boost fire also works as a switch. I just saw. Oh, Jesus, I'm feeling so hard. So hard, so bad, just do that. And that's just the easiest way to get through that. I mean, that's the only way you can go on that, but yeah. Just jump on this, and because I'm pretty sure there's spikes down here or something. Yeah. Jump on these, jump on these, jump on that, jump on this, jump on that. So try it last to land on that one. If not, you can just wait for it to come back up, and then you'll have a clearer view of where you're going. Another spider thing is to like, grab you. I think if you fall down there, you die. So curse from the screen. Anyway. Big. Big is this one? Yep. I'm gonna try and land on top of that, go over here. Ignore this mouse completely. And voila. Checkpoint. Let this one lift up because I'll probably die otherwise no matter look. Ignore that guy, I don't know how he didn't hit me, I must have jumped over his body for something stupid like that. Oh god, oh god, oh god. I pressed the wrong move button. I pressed shift. Oh dear, I've got all this again. Oh, probably went left. MLG! Oh god. Let's check out this one real quick. Oh, I've got no point in doing that because there's rings here that I want to collect. There you go. And here we are at the boss. Part one of the boss, anyway. I just like to do this, it's probably the easiest way possible to do it. You just have to know when this thing's gonna stop. Like right now. Just do that. And we just... You wanna like go. It's just like the easiest possible method of defeating this boss. I don't know why it shrinks every time you use the laser beam. I mean, yeah. And there you go, that's incredible. And if you haven't already, I know I didn't mention this in the last episode, but in the last, like, act. But if you haven't noticed, as Sonic you face proper Eggman, whereas as Knuckles you place, you place, you face a mechanical Eggman. I thought that was pretty neat. Pretty cool, pretty cool. And what you want to do is jump here and use this to your advantage. Screw them rings because they were just getting killed. I mean, why not? Um, this. Oh god. I lost like 80 rings to get 10 rings, you know? That's the way life goes, you gotta spend money to make money, or not even make enough money. But that is irrelevant right now. Anyway, Time Force is potentially the easiest boss in the box. Yeah. Really easy boss if you're Sonic. Kind of a complicated boss if you're Knuckles. You drop through the middle, or you just jump on him like that. The thing you want to do is jump in there and it'll release his fire. I'll make him do this twice, and then he should start jumping up. Okay, three times, and he should start jumping up. One thing to take note of is I'm failing really, 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 really bad right now. Uh, oh, oh. I'll meet you back when I beat Final fucking me, I made the fucking final boss die. It took me so many freaking trials. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna leave that for the end of this video. Uh, I'll do both. Level 1 and level 2 of Sonic. Next level is my favourite level in the game, and also my least favourite level in the game. Because Act is my favourite, which is this bit. Do, 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 do. Oh anyway, yeah, so and Act 2 is my least favourite one in the game. Anyway, so getting on with what I was going to say, uh, there's my friend called Dylan from college and his friend who's called like Alpha Gaz or something like that. They do Minecraft videos together and they post them on YouTube. Dylan has a couple of solos and this Alpha Gaz guy doesn't record. But anyway, if you'd like to give them both a sub, because I believe this Alpha Gaz guy is probably going to start recording anytime soon. And just leave them some love, leave them some support. Uh, if you like Minecraft, yeah. If you don't like Minecraft, don't go troll, because um, he's like, yeah, he's an alright lad. 
comes up with some very interesting stuff. I mean, you'd like to listen to him, trust me, he's got some diff he's got an original imagination, let's just put it that way. And um yeah, hope you like this video. Comment and rate and all that crap. And uh yeah, peace out, motherfucker.